boys and girls. What is your favorite thing about springtime? One of my favorite things is getting to observe God's creation. I just love it when the grass starts turning green and when the plants start to poke out from the soil and the buds bloom on the trees, ready to wake up from a long winter's nap. One of the most amazing things though is getting a glimpse of a butterfly. Have you ever had the chance to observe a butterfly closely? They are amazing. Butterflies are such unique or special creatures because they don't start life as a butterfly. Do you know what a butterfly is called when it comes out of its egg? That's right, it's a caterpillar. Over the next few weeks, we're going to learn a lot about butterflies. We'll read some books together and we'll even get to observe some real live caterpillars and butterflies. Today we're going to read a story called Bugs A to Z. This is a really neat book about a lot of God's creatures, but we're going to share the parts that are just about butterflies. Are you ready? Bugs A to Z. What letter does the word b b bugs start with? That's right, it's the letter B. Can you point to the letter B in the word bugs? Bugs starts with the letter B. In this book, we're going to learn about b b butterflies. Butterflies also starts with the letter B. And in this book, Bugs A to Z, we learn about lots of different types of butterflies. Go ahead and read along with me now. Whether they are flying, crawling, or hopping, Bugs are special creatures. Let's take a closer look at bugs from A to Z. In this book, there are bugs for every letter of the alphabet. We're only going to look at those letters that are about butterflies. Are you ready? B is for butterfly. Butterflies taste food with their feet. A butterfly sucks its food through a tube that unrolls from its head. It's called a proboscis. Can you say proboscis? C is for caterpillar. Caterpillars are baby butterflies or moths. A caterpillar has a long body made up of 13 segments plus a head. Every caterpillar has six eyes on each side of its head. Imagine what you could see with six eyes. H, H is for hornworm. Hornworms are some of the largest caterpillars. They can grow to be four inches long. O, O is for orange tip butterfly and Oregon swallowtail. Which of these butterflies do you think is the orange tip butterfly? Can you point to it? That's right. It's called the orange tip butterflies because it has orange on the tips of their wings. Only male orange tip butterflies have orange on the tips of their wings. The females have white wings. The Oregon swallowtail butterfly drinks nectar, the liquid that is inside of flowers. This butterfly is the state insect of Oregon. P, P is for painted lady butterfly. Painted lady butterflies are known for their colorful wings. They migrate or travel from North Africa to Europe every summer. That's a long way for a butterfly to travel. Q, there are two types of butterflies that start with the letter Q. Queen butterflies and question mark butterflies. Female queen butterflies lay eggs on milkweed plants. When the eggs hatch, the baby caterpillars eat the plant's leaves. Question mark butterflies get their name from the shape of their wings. The front set of wings forms the shape of a question mark. Really neat. V is for viceroy butterfly. Viceroy butterflies are often mistaken for monarch butterflies. They have orange and black wings too. X, 
is for the Xerxes blue butterfly. Xerxes blue butterflies have been extinct since the 1940s. That is almost a hundred years ago. To be extinct means that there aren't any more. They were known for their bright blue wings. Z. Z is for the zebra swallowtail butterfly. Zebra swallowtail butterflies have black striped wings. They also have long tails like zebras. What has been your favorite butterfly to learn about? I hope you enjoyed reading Bugs A to Z. There are so many different types of butterflies. Which ones did you recognize? Which one was your favorite? Go on a butterfly hunt this week and see if you can identify the types of butterflies that you see. Or have mom and dad check out the links to make a beautiful butterfly craft. Have fun, I'll see you again soon, bye.